Hi everyone, I want to do a quick um, Dollar Tree haul, uh, food items. I went to Dollar Tree yesterday and bought a whole bunch of stuff, but I'm only going to do the, the food items and then I'll do another video on the other items that I got that are not food items because um, I have to start using some of this stuff for cooking. So anyway, um, happy Thanksgiving again, you guys. I know I told you all that the other day, but since it's Thanksgiving right now, and I'm going to try to upload it right now. I um, want to let y'all know uh, or tell y'all happy Thanksgiving, okay? Anyway, I'm sitting on my floor. I have so much stuff. Look, I bought all this stuff from uh, Dollar Tree over here. So that's like in the next video. Anyway, so the first thing I got was um, some of these. I've tasted these be before. These are really good. Rich and crisp crackers. And they're super, super good. Um, there's two... Stay fresh packs. I'm going to use this for a dip that I'm going to make with uh, cream cheese and raspberries. I thought we can use that for the dipping. And then these are new. I've never seen these before, you guys. I got two of these. Uh, this is chocolate pound cake, and I love chocolate, uh, chocolate cake. So um, I picked up two. Like I said, I've never seen these before. They had a lot of stuff at the Dollar Tree I went to. Um, so I only picked up two anyway. Um, it's from American Classic. It's a 10 ounce and chocolate pound cake. So I figured why not give those a try. I think I'm going to use these. I'll probably just cut them up because I was going to make like cookies and cupcakes and all that. But I'm probably not going to do all that. I'm already. Anyway. I don't... Okay. Anyway, um, I probably won't do all that. So uh, what I was thinking of doing with this is cutting them in long strips like this and then putting maybe um. Or actually, what I'm thinking of doing now, now that I just thought about it while I'm on camera, um, I can cut them in bite-sized pieces and then put like um, whipped cream in between, like two little pieces, and then use it like a finger food or finger dessert. So maybe I'll do that instead. But I thought that I thought that was pretty good for chocolate. I've never seen chocolate pound cake at the Dollar Tree, but I got two of those. I actually went to um, Goodwill also yesterday, you guys, and I, bought, I found some some uh, really good stuff. I don't know if I'm going to do a video on that right now, but... And then I took... I took... I bought one of these. I like buying these every once in a while. Uh, I'm going to take this to the... For our camping this weekend. It's just the, nasal, uh, the Nestle Coffee Mate. It's hazel. Which is really good. They also had vanilla. And then these, you guys. I love, love, love these. Oh, my gosh. I only got three, which if they keep having them in stock, I'm just going to stock up on these because you don't have to refrigerate these. Um, where is the expiration date? Or does it or does it not have an expiration date? Um, it's just the Welch's dried cranberries, and it's a six ounce. And, I mean, if you would find these, even if you could find them, which I've never seen at H-E-B or Walmart or Target, um, I'm sure they'll be more than a dollar. But I love these on my salad. Oh, my gosh. It's so good. And I don't see an expiration date, but it's okay because uh, my other one's almost gone. I've been eating with salad. So I picked up three of those, you guys. So that looks really good. I mean, it. Y'all need if y'all have never tasted, of course, some of y'all probably don't like dried cranberries. But they're so good, you guys. Oh, my gosh. I love them to death. Okay. And I'm glad I found this bag because I was looking for this bag. I was like, I know I bought some um, cherry filling. For a cherry pie that I want to make. I love cherry pie, you guys. Actually, I like I love pumpkin, pecan, lemon. I love a lot of different kinds of pies. But I figured I don't think anybody's going to make or take a cherry pie. So I figured why not. Um, so I got this. I've never tried these. Hopefully they're good. And hopefully the cherries are sweet and not too um, like tart. Because mm, I don't like them when they're, you know, when they're not sweet, I don't really like it. But hopefully they'll come out really good. So, I got, and these are 15 ounce. I got two of those. Oh, goodness. And you know what, you guys? Which, the stuff is in my purse. Well, I don't have much of them. I bought some cookies. I have some more, a couple more bags. I bought some cookies also. And I think they're called biscottis or biscottis, biscottis. Oh, my gosh. I forgot the name. But. 45 and fab has bought them before and they're like lemon they're they're, they're like they look like they're lemon filling uh cookies and they're super thin and i don't have the packaging because when i tasted them yesterday when i got in the car oh my gosh literally i only have like two left but they're little packages but i can't show you show you the package because i don't have it 
Oh, 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 wait. <laughs> Hold on. I'm, I know I'm just showing you my, my bag, but let me, sh you know what? I do have a photo because I told myself I would take a photo of them. Yeah. I was close. Okay, right here, you guys. Can you see that? Those, biscolatas. Uh, these are like lemon wafer type things, and they're filled with lemon. That's lemon in the cookie, and then there's lemon filling. That's, in case you're wondering what that is, that's my car. <laughs> um... These are so darn good. They also had straw strawberry, I believe, which I didn't get the strawberry ones. But if they have more of these next week, um, or maybe I'll go there tomorrow. I don't know. I'm going to buy some more. These are so darn good. Ugh, I love them. But that's what they're called, biscolatas, okay? And then let me show you another thing I bought. And I don't have them because I literally, totally, I literally ate the whole bag. I mean, it's just a little, it's just a, it's one of these. It's a uh, Si Senor. They're Charitos Extreme Hot with Lemon. And these, um, the first time I think I remember eating these is when I would go to Mexico City. And my mom would get me some. Oh my gosh, I love them. They're really good. I mean, a lot of people don't like um, stuff like this, but I, I just love them. So I'm glad that they have them at Dollar Tree. But anyway, they're gone. <laughs> I just thought I'd tell you all that. Okay, so... Um, I bought some napkins. These are from the home store, which is not bad. 161 pie napkins. And da -da 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 -da. a few more things, you guys. Um, oh, my gosh. Oh, sorry. I was scratching. Um, I don't have my iPod. I mean, my iPod, my holder with me, so I have to hold it with my hand. Okay. Now, this is, I don't think I've ever seen these in there either. This is luncheon loaf made with chicken, ham, and baked ham seasoning. 12 ounce, uh, it's from the bristle, anyway, I used to eat, not this brand, but I used to eat this, my husband and I used to love eating this, um, it's, I guess it's a, like spam, I'm sure some of y'all have heard of it, but I used to love eating spam, we used to cook it and just put like a, make it in sandwich with cheese and tomatoes, so I figured I would buy a couple of these and try them out, um, and hopefully, uh, I'm looking at all the ingredients on here. Oh, it's not bad. Total carbohydrates, three, and then sugars, one. Oh, okay, cool. Protein, six. Anyway, so I decided to try those, you guys. Um, Y'all let me know. Has anybody tried these? Um, probably won't be trying them till next week because I have... My husband literally filled up our little um, RV refrigerator yesterday. He showed me all the stuff he bought for us. So I... I'm pretty sure I'm not taking these with me. So I got two of those. And then the last thing I got, you guys, was... I might even put my Goodwill haul on here. Because it's just... Um, it's really not too much things. Okay. This. I decided to try these. Uh, made in Italy. Italian lady fingers. Forelli. Uh, traditional recipe. So, hmm. Seven ounce. Never tried this before. I'm trying to think. I think some people have picked these up before, but um, I've never tried them. So, wish me luck on that. I mean, because just because it's made in Italy, it doesn't mean it's going to taste good. Because I have bought something from Big Lots before. Not Big Lots. What am I saying? Ross. And it said made in Italy. And let me tell you, it was nasty. <laughs> um, darn, where's my stuff? Okay, well... I want to, I know I have another one somewhere, but I, oh, I know where it's at. Okay, so let me put my Goodwill thing in here real quick, which I need to put this in a dryer or wash it or whatever so I can wear it today. I got this here. I went to Goodwill when I came from my mom's. I think I paid four bucks for it, and it's really cute. It's just basically a sweater, and I love sweaters, and the sweaters I have that I've had for a while are literally like, they're just... They're just worn, so I figured I'd check out Goodwill to get some more sweaters, but I only found this one. This one, it has like a kind of shiny yarn here. It's real pretty. I like it. It's 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 a, a tan color, a light tan, and it's from Romeo and Juliet Couture. It's a medium, but I thought it was super cute. There's no buttons on it. It's just like a just like a sweater that hangs past my waist, which is good because I like the longer sweaters with jeans. But I got that. I figured that would be super awesome. Oh, I forgot to show y'all this. I got another one of these, you guys. I bought one of these last year, and they work really well. So I figured I could put some of my um, goodies in here. Okay, back to my Goodwill. Okay, so when um, 
when the hurricane hit down here in Texas, you know, a lot of my Christmas lights I had up and literally tore those suckers up. <laughs> and I had like the icicle type uh, Christmas lights. Um, so I love looking at Dollar Tree, I mean at Goodwill for Christmas items because I have bought a lot of Christmas items in great condition. Some were brand new. You know, well, I consider them brand new because they're still in boxes. But um, I have bought Christmas lights from there before. So anyway, I saw these here, you guys. This is $1.99. And these, the ones that I had on my house um, before the hurricane destroyed them <laughs> were the icicle ones. Now, y'all know how pricey the icicle ones can be from the Walmart or HEB or wherever you get them, Target. And I found some. I was so excited. I couldn't believe they were $1.99. I was like, are you kidding me? $1.99? Like, what? Um, doesn't have the original price, but I know these are pricey because I've, I've, I've seen them before at uh, Walmart. Anyway, 300 count, $1.99. And it's, uh, um, the colored ones, which is super cute because the ones I had last year, um, and I tried them out at the store were just the white ones, which actually were, were, let me see when I bought them, they were supposed to be that I've had them on there for a couple years. So I probably needed just to get new ones. They, I believe they were blue icicle lights, and then just from the wear and tear, they turned like off white, and they're just nasty. So it was time to replace them. But I was so happy to find them. So it's a indoor outdoor, eighteen feet, and they, like I said, they all work. They're brand new. I couldn't believe that they were there, so I grabbed them. The lady that um, the cashier that I talked to, she said, because I told her I can check all the box. She goes, "Sure, sweetie." <laughs> Anyway, she said it's an elderly lady brought them in and that they work perfectly. And sure enough, so I picked up three. There's that one. And then I have another one in here, which I was so happy, like I said. Oh, and this one is in the bag, but it's the same kind. And it's, the only thing is it doesn't have the box, which is fine. And then here's another one, brand new, $1.99. Oh, <laughs> talk about my container box, you guys. Here it is. The Biscolata, 3.53 ounces. And they're so good. Oh my gosh, they're just so yummy. Okay, and then another thing I found, which has to do with Christmas lights, which I'm happy to find, were these. Now these are expensive also. These were also $1.99, I think I just said that. <laughs> they're twice the lights in the same amount of space. So high density, multicolored net lights. And they're, they're colored, so it's perfect. And I have another one like this. They go around the your bushes. Um, I'm going to put mine around the trees in the front. It's lighted area, four foot by four foot. But good thing about this is over a year ago also, I found some one pack also from, um, I think it was from Goodwill also. So I'm pretty excited to get those. And get my junk out of the way. And I think that's it, you guys. But yeah, that's it, you guys. Uh, thank you for watching, you guys. Like I said, have a happy Thanksgiving. And when I get a chance, when I come back from the beach or whatever, I have a whole bunch more bags, all that, all that right there that I have to do for Dollar Tree, uh, Dollar Tree haul. So let me let you go because I put some potatoes on. I'm going to make some green bean casserole, some candied yams, some, um, what else am I going to make? A couple of pies. So I'm getting very busy. So I will talk to y'all later, you guys. Have a blessed, blessed, blessed day and blessed weekend. Okay. Alrighty. Bye-bye.